want to thank you guys for joining me on another video. It is me, the 413 Mass Digger. I'm actually out at a part of my woods I've been to quite a few times. Obviously, you see it's so big, you can never cover everything, but I don't know if you can tell right there. There's a little, uh, this used to be some kind of picnic area because there's like an old stone, like, grill of some sort built into the ground right there so i thought i'd mess around here for a little bit see if we could pick anything up as always guys appreciate you being on this journey with me so we're gonna see what we can get over here and catch you on the next hole check that find out guys i don't know if that's real dirty or if that's almost like gold plated almost probably a fork at one time really old right near that grill that I pointed to on the ground that's very cool I like that who knows how old that was almost looks like one of those three prong forks very cool can't see it right there on the top but still a little shiny Let's keep it going. What a good find. I like that. Really not a big deal here. I guess my main point is always check around big trees. Really deep right there. I had a choppy coin signal. Ended up being a wheat penny. Nothing crazy special, but I always have good luck around big trees for some reason. But yeah, wheat penny. Hopefully it's a 1914D or a key date or something. Let's keep it going. Well, this signal right here, guys, sounded like hell on earth. And it ended up being a coin. And I can barely see on one side. It's a, uh, it's either an Indian head penny or a flying eagle. I'm going to go with Indian head penny because it says the one cent on the back. But... I definitely cannot tell. Let me see if I could uh, spray it again. When I sprayed it, you could see. You can definitely see the one. See the one in the middle there. One for one cent. Definitely in, I'm going to say Indian head penny, but definitely can't tell on that right now. That would be great if it's a flying eagle. I highly doubt it, but probably won't get a date on that either, but let's keep it going. Good hunt so far. Absolutely unbelievable, guys. I've dug handful of holes over there is where that grill was i told you about in the beginning of the video i got to this hole right here i had an insane signal like 31 33 on the equinox guys check what i just saw out absolutely incredible it's a walker I haven't got one of those in so long, guys. Absolutely amazing. Oh, I can't tell a year on that. 44. Unbelievable, guys. If you guys been watching me for any amount of time, you know I haven't got one of these in such a long time. Oh, what a beautiful coin. Easily the beautiful, most beautiful half dollar we have here in the States. What a coin, guys. I'm going to hit this area hard, see if I can find anything else, and definitely get that cleaned up and get you some pictures, guys. What a killer find. Let's keep it going. I did bring spray, guys, and uh, it's hard to do everything with one hand and run the camera, but got it cleaned up a little bit for you. What a beautiful coin. Hopefully the day continues like this, guys. Let's see what else we can get. Hell yeah. Let's go. It's 
So check this find out, guys. This hole right here, I had a real wacky, like 31 to 38. I already checked the hole. There's nothing else in there. But look at this thing I found here. I know it looks like nothing, but that's an old piece of a ring. Probably held a stone or something at one time. It's most definitely silver. There's no doubt about that. So yeah, it's pretty wild. I don't know if that's going to be a ring or if it held something special or what, but that's most definitely silver. Has a nice ornate edge on the end of it there. But yeah, that had to have held a, a big stone or something at one time. That's pretty damn cool, I'll say that. Yeah, one more piece of silver for the scrap bucket. That's it. Let's keep it going. Check this signal out, guys. Rang up like a 25, 26. Thought it was maybe a, a memorial penny. Check this out. This is sterling on the back. Looks like it's broken half. So I'm going to... Maybe look for another half. I don't know. It's pretty weird, whatever it is. It's pretty damn cool, though. Let's keep it going. It's funny, because this spot all used to be waist high. You can't tell right there, but that's a really old... Uh, Almost like picnic. This is an old picnic area anyway. Long story short. But it's like waist high and prickers and stuff. They bulldozed it all down. And uh, yeah. I'm out here swinging. Got a handful of wheat pennies so far. I just found that little silver piece somewhere around here. Got to this hole right here guys. There's signals all over the place over here. So I'm going to check everything. But we got some silver. It's going to be a Merc dime. Awesome. Let me see if I could get the spray out. Sweet. I definitely can't tell a year on that, guys. I'm blind as a bat. Looks like 44 or something, maybe. Kind of like that uh, half dollar I dug. But let's go. I'll take a piece of silver all day. Hopefully there's some more. Let's go. Alright, guys, where I just got that Merc, I just buried the hole, and I'm definitely still seeing something under there. I didn't pick it up with the pinpointer, which was kind of odd. But there's something definitely down there. I don't know what it is. And it's ringing kind of high, so could be a nail, could be something just mixed with it. I don't know. Let's see what we got. piece of copper wow there's a bunch of stuff in this hole Look at all this stuff. I 
that's a round piece of copper. We got this piece of metal, whatever the heck that is. I wonder why the signal sounded crazy. Well, we got mercury dime, a couple pieces of weird copper, whatever. Is that a ring? Nah, that can't be a ring, but it's kind of ornate. It's got designs on it and stuff. It's pretty wild. And we got this, whatever the heck it is. A mercury dime and this stuff in the same hole. Pretty wild. Let's keep it going, guys. Uh, mercury dime and stuff was right there. Got over here. You never know what you're going to find. It's an earring. That's pretty cool. Couldn't tell you if it's silver or whatever. Just plated something probably, but... Still different. It's a piece of history. Someone wore that at one time. That's pretty cool. Onward. Check this find out, guys. That's an old brooch or a pin or something. You can see where the pin went. That had a bunch of stones in it at one time. Wow, that's old. That's awesome. Hell yeah, what a find. That's really old. Definitely was a pin or a brooch of some kind. That's a score. I'll take that all day. That's a nice relic. Let's keep it going. Uh, I'm going to come right over here. Mercury dime in that hole. Got to this hole right here. I'm pretty sure it was another silver. Could be clad. I don't know. Oh, no, that's silver. That's going to be a merc. Oh, hell yeah. Another mark, guys. Can't beat that. Can't tell the year on that one either, but I'm not going to waste my time spraying it right now. But two marks for the day. Half dollar the other day. Can't beat it, guys. Let's go. Looks like we got a little pistol ball here. It's definitely what it is, looks like anyway. Way smaller than a musket ball, so I definitely say pistol shot or something. Let's go. What a find here, guys. That's awesome. Some kind of religious medallion for sure. Hell yeah. Well, that was the wrong thing to say. But that is awesome. I love it. Let's see if I can get that cleaned up for you guys and get some pictures. Had a Pretty awesome couple days of hunting, guys. See if I can find any more. Definitely something on the back, too. That's awesome. Let's keep it going. This hole, right, actually, I had a good signal in that hole. Nothing there but nails. I don't know what makes nails sound so amazing sometimes in the ground. But this hole right here had a choppy high tone. 
Talk about heart, uh, heart stopper, guys. Look at this. It's like half dollar size. I couldn't tell you what that is. It almost looks like a coin on one side, but this side is like kind of almost rounded out and smooth. I have no clue what that is. Something went there, though. Wow, that's amazing. Almost looks like there's something on the other, some writing on there or something, or a design. I'm not sure. It's definitely smooth on that side. What is that? Almost looks like there's a writing or a picture or something on there. I'm going to have to try to get that cleaned up, guys, and let you know. Definitely didn't sound great, so it's not fully copper, whatever it is. But I'll try to figure that out and let you guys know. It's funny because I thought this was a bottle cap, so I pretty much scratch the daylights out of it pretty cool I can't put a date on that by any means but can't even tell the name of it uh, I can't see right now guys but that's a cool find find quite a few of these over the years not the same brand but let me see what it says in there huh I can't read that can you guys read that probably not still pretty cool almost done here guys let's go As always, guys, appreciate you joining me on this video. If you enjoyed the video, please help me out by liking and subscribing. It is a huge help for all you guys that continuously watch me every video. You know I appreciate you guys more than anything. Unfortunately, this is the end of this video, guys. Got a good one coming up. We're going to catch you on the next one, all right? We'll see you then. Later.